Kiyoshiki's first international level competition outside of USA. He is ready. We can see it. We can see it. And his opponent from Poland, Alex Kurdecha, two years older, 50 kilos lighter. But why, what we saw from his entrance, it's a different Alex that we saw the whole week. Whole week, it's all fun and jokes until he gets to the table. Two armorsling giants going at it, you know. I think Alex is a little bit more established, high in the world rankings. We have seen Alex multiple times. But a lot of people, Corey, especially ready? on North ready? America, Let's believe go. that this is the moment for Corey West. Corey West is ready to get into the World Top 10 rankings, ready to shock the world, ready to see and show everyone who is Corey West. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Corey West, United States of America. Alex Kadecha of Poland. Two true monsters, 200 kilos, 150 kilos are about to collide at the arm wrestling table. And a real clash of styles. I said in the build-up, one of the unhookables, Corey West, he invites you to hook him. Can he be top-rolled, however? You might have no choice. If anyone can, that's us back the hand and wrist. Kadecha could be that guy. Turn for me, guys. Do Rotate not blink. Okay, so many, many lessons to be learned from this first hit. Turn for me. Turn for me. A little bit more. Come on, help me out. Alex, super wrist. explosive. Back here. Looking wrist. for that top roll. Wrist. Go! Big draw! Oh, look at that oh, massive the drive! Cook. Corey West has arrived! Wow! <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. No fouls, coincidental. Both of them went over the pad. I would like to see a slightly different angle on that one because I couldn't see Corey's elbow. And the one thing I would say is Corey West caught that beautifully and he forced the game to where yeah. he wanted it to be. And he is fast becoming a very, very impressive arm wrestler. He had a great mental attitude coming into this. Corey was confident but quiet. Approached it with a lot of belief in his ability but no arrogance. Similarly, Kadecha hungry he believes in his skills he believes like i talked with him so many times and he is sure he will not be top roll he said like there's no chance and if he does i'll just gonna change things up and i don't see alex changing things up that much and looking at the replay there big elbow infringement from alex there i think corey off the front to catch the referees having a little look at that making sure that they're happy with the call yeah, coincidental elbow foul, so no elbow foul is called or on either of the athletes. And that's great for us. We don't want the foul count. We want the round yeah, count. Alex, we want it clean. We want it hard. We want it fair. What he's giving you. And here we go. West. Agarecha. USA versus Poland. Hook versus stop roll. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Opposing styles. Okay, Alex, you're climbing on us. Okay, look at you. Climbing on us. You can see... That Alex Kadecha had them. a real wake-up call there in terms of the danger yeah, no. Corey West carries. Have to come off there, Alex. Corey's like so that. big, he just, no, it's okay. like he sets okay. his shoulder in, it looks like there's no one else, just him on table. He's okay. so square. big. He really is. I mean, Corey West has a dark Help side. <laughs> Bring it in or go out. <laughs> yes. The man is huge. He is. He closes down. There is no air. There is no space. You want to cover your thumb? Yeah. You want to cover your thumb? Yeah. Alex? Yes. No moving, Shoulder. gentlemen. Shoulder, Corey. That hand is thick. Very hard to get through. We'll see. No moving. Referee's no grip. Way over my thumb. Wait, I can't even see my thumb at all. Uh, Both men not really happy there. We're going to open up that. Okay. And it's nice to see Bill Side Collins, a calm head prevailing again there, listening to both Shoulder. men. He just splits Squirrel them, breaks Corey. them up, and we'll go Squirrel. back this one back this to one a second set up. Alex wasn't happy with the shoulder. Kadecha wasn't happy. Shoulders. And the ref's and gentlemen. Neither was Corey Shoulders. West. Corey West complaining Corey's just about looking at the ref. Go! Big drive. Catches. Now this is Corey interesting. West catches. Corey West has actually caught hold of Alex, but he's done so with the lower two fingers, and he needs to be intelligent about Strap. this because that could put a little bit of tax Strap. on that yeah. hand and wrist. Yeah. And he needs to keep that hand and wrist fresh. 
So a very interesting turn of events there, Ray. And uh, we're going to be tying these guys together in a moment and more information there. But uh, you would have to say, at this point in time, the pendulum opportunity is swinging slightly in favour of Corey West. He had the hand control. I don't think he's going to be too taxed there. As this is a guy that trains... I think referees are looking at the replay oh, and uh, maybe yeah. there was an elbow infringement there. I'm hoping not. I mean, for me, that's going straps all day. I think we're chasing shadows a little. Yeah. But I talk with Corey, and I know from Alex, both of them really doesn't want a strap. They want to arm us outside the strap, but there's no chance this match can be contained. Let's go, gentlemen. Bill Collins calls the men back in. Alex Kadecha will be happy at, at least that he got a slight amount go, of gentlemen. purchase and direction right. into that. He needs to make those adjustments. Yeah. Because or the referee's grip. Okay, so Corey West is, is looking impressive. The one question I had for Bill only. Collins was like, do you have strap Don't long move. enough? These hands are not normal Don't size move. hands. These are like, Can't go much lower three my hands, right like put in a sandwich. Higher low car. Uh, These higher. are thick yeah. boys. Oh, they're, they're without a shadow of a doubt. I mean, I ran into Corey West the other day when we were in the corridor, and as soon as I shook the man's hand, I thought two things. One, stay away from my wife, and two, Stay away from my wife. Open, gentlemen. Don't ask Jody who I'm doesn't stay away from your wife. <laughs> Corey West. Michael Todd's been telling us how powerful this guy is for a while, and he's got a pretty hectic calendar. Corey West will be pulling the goal, John Brazinka, okay. a few weeks' time. Yeah, like two weeks. So we'll be looking to come out of this without any damage. Okay, shoulders. This. Round number one been taking quite some time. I think both the guys are getting a little bit exhausted, but we'll see. We'll still have to pull five more rounds after this one. So the moment of truth, first time straps applied. No Don't moving. Move hands, be ready. No, 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 no. What is that? What is this? What is it? Is his move, not mine. What are you saying? I'm going to give you that. We're going to set it one more time. I'm going to give it, then we're going to start the match. Alex Kadecha wasn't happy there at all with the way that that hand came down. Felt like Corey gained some advantage in the hand as it closed. All right. Corey, bring the shoulder in. Corey looks confident. He, he really is. does. Yeah. Very confident. No moving. Be ready. Down comes that second hand. Go! And away we go! In the way of drive and Kadecha. Waited a little bit there and mistimed that. Oh. And that's a big counter attack from Corey. The Gorilla West with the win. Corey West with the win. <laughs> running foul on West. We're going to restart them. Oh. He was on the running foul. He's still just round one. Out. Still round one. One. Yeah. There's no fouls. Oh, no. One elbow foul on Corey West. Corey though. West yeah. on the runner. He won the round. Remember, guys, the running one foul. Elbow foul. The athlete must win to get the restart, and that's exactly the situation we find ourselves in now. But he still has that foul. The foul will stay live. Again, the referees, I think, are going to have a look at that one, but Alex Kadecci was furiously calling that early on. Very critical point in that match. Kadecci got a little bit of a bite, and there was no balance point at all at that time for Corey West. However, the pole had run out of space. Because of his size, he'd hit the back of the pad and he couldn't go any further and it created a resting point. At that resting point, he lost the momentum. The balance was regained by the Gorilla and from there, West went on the offensive and he did so with venom. Enough venom to finish the match. A massive drive from the Gorilla. And that may not give him a round, but it will give the young man from the United States of America massive confidence. Somewhere in the United States, there's very happy Michael Todd at this moment. It's, but it's still, scoreboard shows 0-0, so we still have full six rounds of arm wrestling. Which is remarkable, because I don't know about you, but I'm already tired. The intensity <laughs> yeah. is off the scale. This, uh... You can feel the tension coming off the table. These two guys are really, really... There's a lot of power oh on the table, God. and they're so evenly mashed, in my opinion. You the real question from Alex, and in his mind, he's just like, can I crack this wrist? Can I do something with this wrist? 
Corey is so good at containing and staying flat wristed. He keep he's very good there, and it's very hard for Alex to get something going. The man is incredibly difficult to top roll. It is as simple as that, and he, he challenges you to hook with him. He told me earlier, anybody who comes in hooking me, I just don't see me losing. Now Alex again baited that hand and wrist and needs to hang there. Don't keep adjusting the position, but he's, he's oh, oh, a little turning point, but again, no, both adjustments. It was too far. That was a foul, I believe. It was still and that is greener, yeah. And he oh, needs the pin. According well, to well, Alex you know, it was too. He saw you. Now, we will see that on the replay, but one thing I can tell you which is critical there is that that is a momentum good, shift good, in favour, back in favour of the pole. Because Alex Kadecha baited the hand and wrist, hung out there, and he forced Corey West to make the move. It's what I was talking about a minute ago. If you move too quickly, you lose position. Stay calm, hold that spot. On that After second replay, start, that's exactly. Winner. It is a pin. It is a pin. 1-0 Alex Kurdecha coming back from, from being hooked three times in this match and turns it in a W. And one thing I can say there is we've seen the momentum shift. The momentum was firmly in the corner of the gorilla. He didn't have any pins to show for it, yet he was the man who was carrying the momentum in the match. Not the case right now. He had good control, but off the start, still Alex can gain that position. He's really tall. And all, I think all the stress of this match is going through Corey's wrist. And it can get tired. And it can get tired faster than Alex's back pressure. So he needs to be very careful. He needs to think, stop. And again, he's even at now, he had like good position for a top roll, to be honest. We saw the end of that round there, but yeah, there was, was an elbow start. foul earlier off the front. It was called early. To be fair, the down ref was all over it. That yeah. was the running foul on the end of that. A different pin that we saw Six that resulted in the win for Kadecha. Can you give me a replay on this, please? And we just heard from Bill Collins. He's going, I'm going to look at it. It's fine. It's fine. We'll no, 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 no. No, no. Alex Kadecha, no, no. one pin to the good as things stand right now. Poland edges in front, and the key question right now is Has there been any collateral damage in the hand and wrist of the gorilla? Corey West, an acid weapon of the man from the United States, is that incredible hand. It really is a difficult thing to counter. So thick and so powerful, the wrist. What's more impressive is. Corey doesn't have like huge hand, but it's very thick and really, really strong. Oh yeah, he was off the pad, off the pad yeah. twice in that match. Yeah. So we're going into round number two. One zero. Alex Kurdecha leads this match. It is only one zero, and you know what, Ray? You don't do feel that, like th this, go, this could easily shift back against any yes. one of these guys right now. Yeah. This is far from over. I think there's a lot of things going to be involved in this match, and endurance is one of those. Because I think in some positions, they're so evenly matched like that they that both right Keep it they have the expenditure of power Shoulders. pretty Shoulders. damn even. You, both you guys Who has sorry. the gas tank? You know what yeah. else I want to see here? When the wrist is facing away from the referee, does it make a great deal of difference for Kadecha? We're yes. about to find out. And his wrist. The wrist now away from yeah. Bill Collins. Yeah. Big drive, not a great deal of difference, but again, he's taxing the hand and wrist. Yeah. We'll go into the strap. Yeah. Corey just needs to let go. Get that strap. Because all the power of Alex Kurdecha right now is going through that hand and wrist of Corey West. How many wrist curls can you do with 150 Open kilos? Hands, exactly. Exactly. West. One foul. 150 kilos coming no. at you full speed. Did he just call a foul on Alex there? Yeah. I'm, I'm pretty sure we saw we got a foul called on Alex Kadecha. I'm sure we'll find out in a minute, but it certainly sounded like it. Bill Collins. Okay, shoulders, both you guys. Help me out, help me out. Shoulders, you need to come off that thumb. Corey West. Edging forward with that shoulder. Alex, you're gonna have Shoulders to. and front. Okay. I gotta get it here looking first. For the height. Okay. Let me get it here first. That's some heavy breathing, and we are just in round Shoulders. number two. Shoulders. And for anybody who's about to accuse him, that is Both not you guys Michael Todd. Why do you guys turn for me? Somewhere Rest. in USA, Rest. there's very angry Michael Todd right now. I can't see you, sir. No, I love you, Michael Todd. Okay, look at you. Okay, we're going to the referee's grip. Let's go, let's go, come on. Referee's grip, round number two. This is intense I know you're watching Michael Shoulders. and I know you're gonna be proud of boy, your boy the gorilla he's performing you said he would 
Alex Kadecha leads by one pin, but this is a thriller. And we're making these big boys sweat. Okay. Both of you guys score your shoulders up for me. Shoulders still not in the position. And don't move. You can back Poland's Either Alex Kodecha, the United States of America's own in. Corey, the Gorilla West. We are in don't the set them. grip. Be Don't ready. climb up on it. Yeah. It's a foul if he does. Go! There's the big drive again in a similar theme. Oh, big climb from Alex Kadecha. And Alex now can't do damage. Kadecha there. Yeah, that's, that's a very, very key moment. Kadecha, for the first time, bust open the hand and was able climb. to put a little bit of pressure and strain into those massive fingers of the gorilla. Oh, and the you could see. The disappointment on There's Corey West's runner, face. Running foul on Corey back? West. Come on, Corey. So coming into this round, Alex has one foul and Corey West has running foul. So effectively a foul apiece oh. right now. Yeah. But Corey needs to win this round to get a restart on the round. The guys in the back, give me some playback. And we go to a replay for the fourth time in this patch. And we're still in round number two. You know, that's not a bad thing at all, though, because Bill Collins wants to be sure that yeah. he's making the right call. He knows how much this matters to these athletes. Hey guys, and neither one of them will begrudge that. Yeah. Bill Collins, his usual ultra-diligent self, he's going to check that. And we know we're going to get the right result there because he's got the opportunity to see exactly what happened. Hey, give me some playback over here. <clears throat> And what do we see in that replay? Yeah. Unfortunately, well, we couldn't see Corey's elbow Al Al there. Alex's elbow there was go. planted deeply on a pad. It wasn't Alex. Uh, it, looks, it looked clean from... from uh, no, there was. You saw it right there. As it re rewound, oh, Corey yeah, was on the run, right. without question. He popped the front. Oh, the it was a runner. Corey West oh, drove forward. I, I think it was like a sweat reaction, really. I mean, the guy's a monster and he's sweating heavily. And Corey West there, as he tried to plant that elbow hard, and he dug it deep, it just popped off the front momentarily. Nothing he can do about that, but unfortunately, he, he pays a heavy price. And that is the running foul for the gorilla, Corey West. So the scoreboard still says one elbow there foul it is. each yep. and you can see one it. victory let's go, Alex. To Alex all right, let's go. still round number two but the most notable thing there was the adjustment from Kadecha. that time he wasn't hanging oh, out with it. no hand no. he gained he climbed and he climbed at the right no. time now why was he able to do that you can <laughs> you can say that it was just a swing in fortunes or you can say that it's evidence that Corey West's hand is starting to feel the abuse of having this gigantic pole hang off it I must admit, I'm very experienced with having a gigantic pole in my hand. And on occasion, my hand does tire. I know how that feels, Corey West. Yeah. Okay, Neil. Okay. So, still no straps. One running foul on Corey. One elbow foul on Alex. Over my thumb in the ref's grip. No, lady. Yes, you have my whole thumb. Listen, listen. I got the grip. Hey, I got the grip. Big drive again. Ah! I don't think go we've to got a any strap? infringement. Oh. Yes, we're like going to a strap. Tied together. Let's get these guys tied together. And uh, this this been like a long match for just one round, to be honest. Yes, here we go. Things get exciting. I think, I think it takes go, so gentlemen. long just because the guys are so evenly matched in some positions. In positions that where they both Let's stop. Go, Alex. So there's a lot of fighting. Both of them really want to win. Okay, get back. Get back. This is this is big opportunity. Just get the strap on. I think Corey West, Corey West needs needs and wants to show the world how great he is. Thumbs down only. Hold it right there, gentlemen. We're in a rest grip. Yeah. Here we go. The strap will be on Corey's hand, buckle, 
I don't think it makes at this point any any difference because he's not fighting for that top position. He just wants to hook Alex. He wants to stop him, either in the palm or wrist. Doesn't matter. He needs that closed wrist, in my opinion. He's got to. If the wrist gets folded back, I, I don't think that unless a lot of fatigue goes into Alex, I don't think Corey's going to have the top end strength to pull him back. I may be proven wrong, but at the moment it doesn't look like Kadecha is tiring there. It we looks are like very early in this match. Yes. If your hand gets busted back, long night. And we've seen in previous matches from Alex, this guy isn't shy of a battle. He, he's, a, he's got real athleticism. I mean, oh, yeah. he carries that 150 kilo Go! really well. Big driver, get him yeah! first, the hand control. But yeah, Alex Kadecha, big climb again, and he needs to yeah, stay patient. But he's working the hand and wrist of Corey West. Corey West is fighting perfectly at the base and just needs to dig and wait for the yeah! next point. That's a win for Alex Kadecha. Kadecha with the win. Poland with the win. Wow. 2 0. Alex Kadecha takes the lead. We're going to go in round number three. <laughs> what a match, mate. We, w we knew that some of these would light up tonight. Thank you, Corey West. Thank you, Alex Kadecha. It's showtime at King of the Table 4. Can you feel that? And this is only the second match. Ask them. Alex trying to calm in some doubt. So what we saw from Corey West right there was he was fighting for that hand. He didn't want to go fully flop with press. But when he tried him, he was way too low. Alex got the high ground. He was pulling him down, and it was very hard to get him in a good position. Big, big shift in momentum there. The oh, hand and start. wrist of Corey West compromised dramatically. And regardless of the pin, regardless, what we do find out there is that Corey West has great strength at the base, but his hand and wrist, his primary weapon, has been compromised. And that will give a great deal of confidence to Alex Kadecha. And you can see how taxing this is, ladies and gentlemen, because an athletic individual like Alex Kadecha at the moment is blowing like Moby Dick on an uphill right. swim. Alex, to the table. Let's go. Imagine how hard it is when you weigh 150. Neil knows. Okay, Neil knows. But when you are that heavy, it, it really takes toll on you. And when you're so evenly matched, you ex there's so much power going through those arms, you're going to get tired. And it's, and it's Dubai. <laughs> it's, it's so damn hot in here. Okay, grip. Staff is knuckle. Yep, big boys Ray, and thanks for the little compliment there. He doesn't know what that means. You're welcome. It's okay. It's already the line. It's a good yeah, job that is uh, this is Alex Kadecha okay. has done all yeah, that back pressure okay. training because otherwise he'd be really feeling that brack at this point in time because he's been forced onto it all night. He's had to run, he's had to keep that back pressure applied. Rotate for him, body guys. And, then, and at this point, I think Shoulder Alex is very, very confident that he doesn't need a strap. He wants to go. Go! A great deal yeah. of more height there, Ray, yes. you saw from Corey as well. Yeah. He tried to really, he tried to hit the same position, but he tried to do it with a little bit of back pressure applied, and it can make a great deal of difference. Right, gentlemen, back at the table. So at this point, Alex keeps working on that hand. Alex. Every time they go for a slip, the hand down. of Corey West gets busted back a little bit more. More Just he tries to hold on, more he tries to hook, more he tries to resist, down, more down. taxing it will be on him. I was speaking to Corey the other day and we were talking about the opportunity for him to have a plan A, a plan B, a plan C. Well, this is the time to show everything you've got. If you've got a secret card, play it now, Corey West. So, Corey told me if, if he loses his hand or he feels uncomfortable with the position, he just tries to grip low. Gripping low kind of puts more more pressure, more stress on the opponent's pronator. But if your hand is already taxed and you have to deal with a lot of back pressure that Alex Kurdecha has, it's very taxing. And the thing is with Alex, right now, you're not looking at a guy who is absolute finesse. This is a man who's still learning the game. He's never had to be supremely accurate. 
because the movement is backed up by massive power. There's a lot of chaos here in this movement from Alex. And that drive to the side combined with the explosivity, it's very difficult to put the brakes on this man. Cordy Go! Just applying that back pressure, oh, but yeah. that's much more convincing. Yeah! And the issue, I was just going to say, the issue with the back pressure, it doesn't let you plant the elbow as hard. As soon as you lift up into the match and you rise, you I cannot think, uh, plant as hard and Kadecha with the superior height. I think they're finished. Oh, I hope we've not suffered Corey, an injury Corey, there. Corey got a hold of his chest. I think he got an injury there. Oh my word, that would be such a shame. Yeah. Let's let's check with the referees and with everyone else. Are they still pulling or they're finishing the matches right now? It would be a great shame if we lost another match on injury there. Those guys really put it all on the line, but I'm praying that we get to see the conclusion of this match and these guys pull further. If Corey can continue to pull, this is a great opportunity for him to really try different things now. Even if he feels that his primary weapon's damaged, there are things that he can have a go at and try to learn. I would if love if just Alex pulled. goes in a hook. Give me a playback over there. Bill Collins just approached us here and asked for a playback again over there. Bill is being more... He's checking everything. He wants to make sure he does the right calls in every match, in every round, in every grip up. You will not find a more diligent individual than Bill Collins. Let me tell you, this man takes this job extraordinarily seriously. Yes. There isn't a better man for the job. Bill Collins, a rock. Alex Grudecha taking full control of the match, working on Corey West's wrist and hand and doing what he does best, top rolls. <coughs> well, I don't know how your predictions are going, Ray Live Pins. I'm, I'm going to release mine on the conclusion of tonight's arm wrestling. But I'm on mixed fortunes right now, brother. <laughs> mixed fortunes. <laughs> yeah, Alex Kadecha. Me too. Okay. So, what is going on? I couldn't hear what Bill said to Alex there, but he is a, it's over. He's it's just over. looked at me. The match is over, oh, ladies and gentlemen. Let is me it over? go over to yeah. speak to our athletes. Uh, Neil Pickup is going to go right now and talk to Corey and, of course, the winner of the match, Alex Kurdecha. Corey West put his heart into this match, tried his best, came out as strong out of the gate, but still, Alex Kurdecha with experience, with a with little better technique approach and not giving in on everything or giving up on anything, came in as a victor today. Corey West, I hope the injury is not that severe and he will be able to continue arm wrestling in the near future. He's holding his chest, which I really don't like. And uh, right now we're going to go to nil pickup. Corey West on those few first on that first round looked extremely good, but Alex showed professionalism as well as experience. Changed some things up, worked Corey's wrist to the max, and in some positions Corey West just needed to be in that strap straight away. He doesn't need anyone to be pulling that hard on that hand. We talked with him and he said he feels he feels more confident without the strap. But in this scenario, yeah, we go to Neil Pickup. 